Good morning. It is 7 a.m. right now. Natalie and Lila are about to meet me and then we're gonna go um, pick up a rental car. We are going on a road trip to Tucson, which is so random, but it's my cousin's daughter's first birthday party and I've never met her before, which I've felt really guilty about. Um, my cousin, her name is Alexa. She and I like grew up together. We're six months apart. She was like my best friend growing up and I haven't seen her in probably like 10 years, which is like really sad and crazy. But I have family that's still in Tucson and I haven't been back to Tucson since I left college, literally six years ago now. And so this is gonna be my first time going back. I'm gonna get to see like my mom, my aunt, my sisters, like all people I haven't seen in a really, really long time and I'm really excited. But I wanted to make a trip of it because like I said, I haven't been back to Tucson. I wanna go back to U of A and walk around campus and like really experience it while I'm there because I don't know how long it's gonna be before I get to go back. But I'm so excited. Lila's coming. Natalie, who you guys know, obviously, is um, from Tucson also. She and I were at U of A at the same time and just didn't know each other. Same thing with Hunter. Like, they, I think they knew each other, but I didn't know either of them. And we just like all ended up in the same group somehow like later on and it's funny. But I think it's gonna be so fun for Natalie and I to be able to like show Lila like, this is Greek Row, like this is what happened in this house, like this is my sorority house, like I'm really, really excited. Bro, good news, bro, good news. She goes, okay, only seven more hours. Well, had we left on time, it would have been a lot quicker. Oh wait, hold on, honestly, I have better news. Six hours and 41 minutes. She has my kombucha And I'm wearing a Wildcat shirt. This is the Tucson tour, baby, let's go. <laughs> I can't believe you're using the viewfinder and still can't get your face. <laughs> okay, I have to go. I'm really scared. This is the one about the dead mom. She probably loves it. <laughs> <laughs> Quickly interrupting to talk about today's video's sponsor, which is Drift. In my last video, you guys heard me talk about Scentbird, which is one of my favorite companies ever, and this is actually their sister company, except instead of making fragrances for you, they make air care products for your home and your car. I particularly want to talk about their car fresheners because that's what I ordered. And just like Scentbird, it's a subscription service, so you get a new one each month. Your first month, they send you a starter kit, so it comes with like a little clip and then the freshener. I got a wooden one. Um, I think the wooden ones are $9 and then and the metal ones are around $14. This is what the little clip looks like. Obviously you just hook it onto your little mirror and then the little scented wood part just um, sticks right to it because it's a magnet. They do like a scent of the month, which is really cool because I, for one, get like scent blindness where I like smell a scent so often that I start to not smell it at all. It's kind of like how you don't know what your house smells like. So it gives you some variety because they'll send you a new one each month and it's inspired by the seasons and it's just, I don't know, a fun way to switch it up. Their products are all made with natural, essential, and fragrance oils and the subscription is super flexible so you can change your subscription or cancel your subscription at any time. Of course I have a code, my code is Brooke55 and it gives you 55% off of your first month at Drift. That makes the whole thing like a few dollars. So so obviously use it. I hope you guys love it. I love subscription services because I feel like it's so easy. It just shows up at your door and you don't have to think about anything. Anyway, thank you Drift for sponsoring this video and let's get back into it. I wanted to grill cheese, but nothing, it for me. nothing's melted, but it is really good because it's like cheese and like a little like cold crunch. It's like Subway. Okay. I just did a full face of makeup in the car. So did Natalie. Now Natalie's driving. We are two hours away. We're gonna be there with like a little bit of sunlight left, so we're gonna show Lila the mall, and then we're gonna go drinking on University. Also, oh my god. We're 20 away. We're here. Okay, it doesn't look very pretty. This used to be Capasig. They got kicked off campus, obviously, for like, I don't know, hazing or something. Lila's going Greek. She's going to Hunter's house. I'm reborn. Which one would I belong in? Um, I think maybe like a John G5. like G5. G5. G5, 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 G5. is like the party horn. It, no, it was, yeah. yeah Honestly, yeah. Is... Turn around. Gorgeous. Look how Her. big and beautiful. Like, that one looks insane. That's, <laughs> that's, that's like, yeah. oh, oh my God. No, it's huge. This was my room. This corner. Wait, you here. lived in this? Okay, first of all, it did not look like this when she was here. Not to, not to hate on her house, but. Did they redo the wall side? Yeah. yeah. This is Natalie's house. She was a DG. Oh my god, how cute. Anchors up, is that what you say? Not really. Oh. Are they closed? Yeah, during the summer. Like, but look how cute. Did you guys ever lay on the scratch? Lila's an alpha fee. This 
is where I had to go to chemistry and then I went through all of it, cried, nearly killed myself, got a C, retook the class because I needed to have a B and I got a C and again. You didn't take it for a full year? Yeah. And learn the same thing over again? Yeah, and then I still got another C so I wasted all my fucking no time. No way. I swear. Dr. Van Doren, count your days. First stop was Illegal Pete's, which is like a little like restaurant where we used to come and like black out. And the bartender was a Lila fan, so he's getting us drinks. We're about to go to the next place. So we just taught Lila what like getting iced means. I can show my mom, she follows you too. Oh, how sweet. So we're about to, we're about to do it to her. In front of frogs. Natalie is such a mom. Okay, come on. This is actually. This is, actually, this is for the cool kids. Oh, so happy. Oh my god, I think I literally have Bella Thorne armed in her. Gross. They're about to ask her. I needed to start you off right with oh. just... Wait, oh wait what? What is this? Enough time. Done and done. My first cry of the day. <laughs> and I haven't even cried. That's crazy. Well, we went to the bar, and this guy was like, oh my god, Lila brought us shots. And then now we're at the second bar, and the girl, Brooklyn, told Brooke, was, oh my god, I just have to say, I'm such a fan of the cancel podcast. Yeah, my bitch is killing it. Duh. I don't know why it makes me happy because it's like, I'm at U of A. I'm like, crazy because we went to school here. Yeah. I'm like, oh. Second shot's over. We're at our third bar. This is no anchovies, okay? And no anchovies is where I probably spent most of my time because there's like a club upstairs. But most importantly, there's delicious, delicious pizza. That is the reason I looked how I looked in college. Oh my God. This is Lila's first bite of a no anchovies pizza. Wait. The crunch is insane. We've had a lot of drinks. We're now on the rooftop at Illegal Pete's because we want to show Lila. Shut up. <laughs> a true Arizona sunset. Um, it's not the best one, I'm gonna be honest, and we don't have the best view. But we have tomorrow night too though. Maybe we'll get a good one. Then. You're right. Natalie and I are um getting to see everything that they've like built since we've left. And it kind of honestly looks like a different campus. These are new. Yeah, the new pipes. Also, never mind. We're having so much fun. Okay, you guys, things are getting a little silly. We're getting a little rowdy. We're getting a little silly. I love people. I hate them. I love people. I love them. What do you think no, about Adam's friends? Those are my best friends. What do you think about Adam's friends? Adam's friends. 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 Chasing it with the frozen marker is crazy, but it's a really good tryout. I'm not a vodka drinker. Me either. I'm scared. But I haven't drank vodka in like months, like years. Well, honestly, no, I, I haven't drank year. vodka. Literally, I'm not joking. Since I left U of A, but I figure since I'm back here, like vodka was my drink of choice. I'm drinking vodka. I'm so scared of us right now. I swear to God, I don't even. If you had a gun in my head, I could not tell you what we drank or eaten or anything. We're in trouble. Look at my face. Oh, we missed the sunset, you guys. Oh, we did. I'm ready. Wait, you guys, I called my mom earlier and she's so excited to meet Natalie and Lila tomorrow. Like, it, like, she, it was actually sweet. She had so many kittens. Yeah. I'm excited though. Brooke literally has been my sis and I haven't heard of her mom since 2019. So I'm like, where the fuck is this bitch? Like, does she actually exist? I get to meet her. We'll see. Nipple I tell so many funny stories, so I'm excited for like people to finally experience she it. She hears them yeah. all. Do you actually tell us yeah. mine? We're at Old Main, the original University of Arizona building. <laughs> it literally says keep out of fountain. What's she gonna do? Hey, Natalie, wait, hang on, hang on, wait. Natalie, do not get us arrested. There used to be an undie run here, and you used to run through the fountain. They stopped it before I went to school here. You guys, fully stripping. I'm getting in. <laughs> I'm getting baptized. <laughs> You know, <laughs> Brooke just got a light swim. Natalie, why? so nice. I'm not even cold. What happened? We went swimming at the pool. 
I've never even been up to the fountain, Natalie goes, I've never, I've never swam in the fountain. I go, I've never even seen the fountain hardly. Listen, I never got to take senior photos and everyone takes their senior well, photos. Well, yeah, cause she called it a day at three and a half years. Okay. <laughs> so everyone comes here in a white dress and they wear their little cap and gown and they're like, and they have the diploma I'm in like, their hands. Hunter, roll the pics. <laughs> Natalie and I were saying like it's healing our little inner child. We went swimming in the fountain. Lila's over there pissing in a bush. Felt like therapy, seriously. Like Natalie and I got in the fountain, so I'm <laughs> soaked head to toe. And I just thought about it, and I go, we're gonna have to check in right now to the Ritz Carlton um, in our soggy clothes. And like, you know what? Whatever. Yeah. We have been in our room for 30 seconds. <laughs> That's gonna cost you. You're, you're kidding. <laughs> not, not in the boat shoe. <laughs> it's the Louis Vuitton. I'm like. Alright, put your swimsuits on, bitches. We got in the hotel room 30 seconds ago. We're already in our swimsuits, but Natalie insists that we see the Big Dipper. There's light pollution laws in Arizona. Stars aren't better anywhere. See, one, two, three, four. Okay, you guys, we found the pool. Not kidding. We had to go on a full camelback hike. I'm pretty sure Lila fell down a mountain. Look how beautiful. Okay. I'm afraid of falling down the stairs. I'm a little drunk, I'm gonna be honest. Oh my God, there's, oh wait, are you kidding? We're getting on those. Well, there's like three little chairs and then you can see, I'm not kidding, every single star in the galaxy. We're gonna lay on our little chairs and we can see the stars. We just found out room service closes at 10. It's 9.55, running, running our tail. Um, oh my god, where did we go? Like, we're all so directionally stupid. Immediately to the phone dialing. Oh my god, if we miss it, I'm gonna cry. We don't even know what we want yet. Something with cheese. We got it, where's the menu? Come on. Hi, um, where can we locate our in-room dining menu? Okay, and we're gonna order right now. We wanna order before you close. I'm so sorry. Right, we're closed until 12 o'clock. So. Oh! Woo! Yay! Thank you so much. Wow. And it's the mashed potato. Oh, wow. We ate that so hard, I'm not kidding. That corn bisque. I don't know what to say about it. We have had ourselves a dire. And now it's bedtime and I have to brush my teeth and put my stupid fucking look Invisalign how this is. It comes with a You guys, look how beautiful it is here. We just saw a literal cardinal fly by a little red bird. Okay, we found the water slide, which is really exciting. These are the vibes. We're at the pool. I just got these barbacoa tacos. I'm so excited. There's lots of onion on here though, wow. And more importantly, we have a pitcher of prickly pear margarita. Also, those were not my tacos. These are my tacos. We have made it to the one-year-old's birthday party. Kaven, we're coming for you. I don't know who of my family is going to be here, so I called my sister and she said she's five away and she's going to walk in with us. I'm scared. I, I haven't seen them in so long. I haven't seen them since I was like 11. This is so cute. You guys, we've been sitting in a little corner. Tori, my sister, and my mother over here have been telling other, the full. Other sister, me and Natalie. <laughs> have been telling the full. Wait, oh my god, look at my burn from earlier this Full morning. life story. Full life story. I feel like people sometimes think like I'm embellishing a little bit with the crazy stories, but I think um, Tori's making them a little crazier. It's a fact. <laughs> Lila said she liked fruit. Fawn came out with this. <gasps> it's finger food. Oh, I love food. finger food. Okay, there's there, but there's forks too, if anybody wants. Aww. Oh, going Poor baby. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Tori and I are both crying. You guys are so the same. I went to Tori to go say, oh, why am I crying? And she was crying too. I'm like, not one. Alexa has a baby. I know.
We're still with my mom talking all, like telling all the stories. Hey y'all, I hung out with so many kids today. Everyone, this is Cassidy. She's Cassidy. one of us. Oh, wait. Cassidy's my niece. She was my first baby that I Cassidy ever took likes. care of. Say hi. And without, without being prompted, what did you call the person you don't like? Yeah! <laughs> Perfect, She's one, She's one of us. You guys, we're doing all the family gossip in a circle. I am not kidding. Tori, my sister, Fawn, her mom, and Brooke all just started bowling at once. Over <laughs> one it's a sickness. No, if you're not a crier, you don't understand. Tori, me, and Dory went outside to like hit a cigarette or something. <laughs> And I, she was like, oh, like, asking about my transition. Within five seconds, she starts bawling. And I'm like, and now they understand. Everyone clowns me for it all the time. They're like, I can't believe you cry. No, so I thought much. it was precious. But it's my family. We've had the best little day ever. We've been, like, my family told, like, all the craziest stories. I've cried 1,000 times. Everything's been so fun. But if you remember from yesterday, we wanted so badly to show Lila, like, an Arizona set, like, a true Arizona sunset. And look at the sweep. It's perfect. We've traveled the world at this point and there is not a doubt that Tucson has the most beautiful sunset. There's no place better. And she's not out here Lila! to see it. Look at it. Stand right here. Now look. Best in the world. Our room surface is here. It is the best day of my life. If you recall my corn chowder from last night, Corn bisque, if you will. I got another one and I haven't stopped thinking about it. Alrighty, you guys, I am home from Arizona and I am on the couch until further notice, okay? I feel like I have been constantly traveling and obviously Tana and I are planning a tour, so we're about to go all over the place and I just need a breather for a second. But I had so much fun in Arizona. I don't know why I don't go back more often, but it was so cool to like show Lila everything, go to campus, introduce them to my family. I don't know. It was really special. I've never introduced any of my friends to my family, so it was just really cool. I can't wait to go back next year. But anyway, I'm gonna end the vlog here. I love you guys so much. Um, thank you so much to Drift for sponsoring this video. Again, use code Brook55. And I think that's it. I love you. What, what is going on here?